50 for uh, top seed in the entire league. And shot side of the goal scores. Blandisi. That one found his stick at the side of the goal and knocks it straight past Joseph Wall as the Rocket get on the board first. Well, this is one of those plays where go to the net, good things happen. Uh, the faceoff win, and they get the puck, and it goes up to the blue line. Belliger. He steps away from one. The Damo on his heels. He takes the shot. Not a lot on it. Patan cleans it up, and he ties it up. Puts it in after Caden Primo makes the initial save, but what a great job as the puck comes up to, to Lilligran and he dangles around the winger coming out to take extra on it. And now Patan, open ice, two on one, Barabanov, Patan, shot, saved by Primo. Great save by the goaltender, but he's down and out and trying to get it back out front quick. Goes Barabanov, no stick here for Primo. Is Nick Patan flips it back over. Gilchenyuk in for Barabanov, in tight, scores! I'll tell you, this is tic-tac-toe for the goal for the Toronto Marlies. And Nick Patan gains the line, the little backhand sauce pass to Gilchenyuk, and a sweet little feed. And look at what transpires is when Barabanov picks it off, he fakes. Barabanov out front, Gilchenyuk shoots, he scores! Pour some sugar on it! Goal here in a Toronto Marley uniform. And I'll tell you, the work again by the Marlies in the offensive zone. You get the puck, Barabanov with an excellent pass. Stood tall, held his ground, and didn't give much to look at. Malone, and this time, shoots it, shelf, scores. Wow. Jesse Yelonen with a bullet right there. And he snaps this as the rocket crossed the Toronto blue line with some speed. And it's Belzeal, and he makes the drop pass, and you've got the defenseman Yelonen following up the play. And he just absolutely rips this over the blocking glove of Joseph Wall. And at the third goal of the campaign. McCossel is skating. He's got Anderson with him as he comes back across the line. Tries to feed it in. Scores! Short-handed goal! Joey Anderson makes it 4-2 for the Marlies. Well, you can almost sense this coming, Croc, uh, as the Marlies have had a couple of great opportunities here on this shorthanded opportunity uh, on that last shift. And then right away again, it's the block at the blue line. And Koslo. Hey, boy, Wall had an eye on it, but looked good. Long distance shot. Scores to make it 4-3 as the Rocket pressure the Marlies and come up with the goal to bring it within one. Well, Josh Brook, second goal of the season has cut it to a 3-2 advantage. But this whole situation where the Marlies get hemmed in their own zone starts with uh, the defense pairing. It was Lilligren and Ru